last we left off, you guys went for another little bout of shopping, getting various bits and pieces of supplies in. You obtained some general resources, such as water, uh, boiled uh, for a bit of it, which I mentioned off camera how much that would cover round up, up, about. Uh, scroll, scroll, scroll. 10 gallons for each person, 40 in total. Uh, yes, so that's potentially 10 days per person, but that does not include washing. That's just simply your basic intake that you require. A day. So, at the end of the session, you guys went to sleep, went about your various little tasks, passed out, and, of course, Kara. Yes? Give me a con save. No. Okay, you fail. Eleven. Mm, okay. Quick little note of that. So, Kara and Jun, you both awoke early, earlier than everybody else. Jun, I'm going to imagine you decided to escape. The smell. Uh, yeah. You sat down, you had your, a, a little game of chess. We were actually just playing chess just before this. Did I have digestive issues? Is that why I'm up over? Who knows? Or Carol. Something woke you, but you don't know what. Okay. Brandon, you are sound asleep. Now remind me, David, did you uh, attempt to reach out last night? I did. Ah, uh, yes. Okie dokie. In which case, you have a sound sleep. So the morning brightens up gradually. Jun and Kara, after you have your little game, what do you do? Your morning. I don't get this game. It's, it's very easy after a few tries, I think. Who we'll understand where, how the pieces will move eventually? You did great. great. Was it your first time? Yes. Oh, wow, you, you actually managed to roll out quite well. I was actually also very, uh, what do you say, distracted by. Uh, what, what did you tell me about your father again? He is planning to do a new business venture or something. What did you say? Oh, he's not planning a business venture just yet. He wants me to take over. Ah, uh, yeah. Hey, you're not looking forward, are you? No. Hey, what, what's it with? Parents and forcing their children to work a specific job, like, we can do what we want, right? I know, right? It's... Pfft. I mean, I'm glad I'm stuck here instead of doing a job I don't like. Oh, I don't, I'm not glad I'm stuck here. I take that back. It's terrible. I'm actually doing a job right now I don't like. Aren't we all? Talking about the job, uh, should we head downstairs, get ready by finding the deer once again? Sure. And with that, June starts uh, taking her way downstairs to the washing area. Get okay. <laughs> Going to assume you're going to do so to wash up. Yep. Also, one aside as well, I'm also going to say that uh, using the bathroom, uh, you would also need to use water to flush the toilets, effectively, to drain it. So, potentially, you're going to have an additional use of water per day. Ah. Uh. Just let you know. 
any use that's within the building. So I'm assuming you wash up? Uh, yeah. Yes. It wouldn't take very much to do so, so I'm not going to deduct any of the water from that. Let's be a splash and a wash. Whilst you're doing so, David, I'm going to say you start to stir. Just lay there for a bit longer awake, thinking about sleeping in a single-sized bed, even though I was used uh, to, to a two-person uh, bed. You should lie there, contemplating what you miss. Motes of dust travel through the air. The light gradually starts to move across the floor as the morning starts to progress a little bit more and a little bit more. Let's see. Until... Get on with it. And I uh, get up. Use press station to clean myself. And uh, head downstairs. Brandon, lastly, you begin to stir. Your head feels fixed in place and your neck aches a little bit. You get to pull forward a little bit to pull your horns out of the bed again. As you ground them into ah. the bed frame a little bit. Oh, God's sake. Okay, uh, let's see what nonsense the world has in store for me today. Oh, that Brandon is going to go downstairs. I'd say, David, as you're making your way down, that's when Kara and Jun are making their way out of the bathroom. Morning. Good morning. Morning, Mr. Uh, good morning. The whole gang's here. And everybody is, um, chirpy. Ah, uh, actually, I mean, yesterday was pretty exhausting, so I actually got a pretty good night's sleep. Unfortunately, my... Uh, a little bit of a uh, sore neck. But, uh... I, I, we found a dragon, uh... What did it say on the box? Dragon chest? Oh, right, you found, a, a, found a... What? Well, it's like basically a chest. Yeah. It's called dragon chest. Oh, uh, neat. It's, um... Oh, are the pieces decorated? Yeah, they all look like dragons. Oh, that is pretty sick. So, uh, what's so the case? Uh, well, we need to try again, don't we? But first, we eat. Yeah, I have some oh, yesterday like left leftovers. Hey, oh, I'll take it. Warmed up by magic. We should also look for some uh, books for Mr. Deathly. Flynn. Flynn. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Yeah, yeah, we definitely have uh, some things to do, but... And... I mean, looking at our... Fridge, um... Right, Mr. Martinez? Yeah, that would be useful. And, and also, we need uh... save for the money of the shop. And we also need to buy some more food, since we are yeah. basically out. Oh, oh, guys, um, actually, I meant to show you this yesterday, I kind of got a little bit sidetracked with, uh, running away from Kara, sorry, sorry, Kara, that was just a bit what? much yesterday. Um, yeah, um, uh, Brandon is going to, um, sort of pull a list out of his, uh, jacket. Yeah, if you have a look at this, this is all the stuff we actually have in the, sh in the shop right now. Mm, you advertised mm. it, that's good. Uh, yeah, yeah, I mean, I had to do something other than just stand there and look pretty yesterday whilst... Uh, that was uh, well, I mean, I was helping... True, true, true. Well, I was helping Kara move stuff around, but I just thought, well, considering she was doing most of the actual organising of what, so I would just uh, make the list. So, uh, hopefully it comes in useful. It's good to know what we have. And then we can also check it so, to make sure that we weren't robbed of anything. Uh, yeah, yeah, true. Um... I'll probably just, um, like, if you guys uh, sell anything or need to make changes to it, just uh, let me know and I'll just uh, mark things off and add things to it as and when. Alright. Maybe, maybe, like, have a total item song so we know what's popular? Well, yeah, but we probably need to actually sell a few items because so far we've sold, what, a short sword and a dagger and the dagger wasn't 
It was a trade, but it wasn't technically a conventional sale. Good that you mentioned that, because I need to figure out what the oh, word the ore? is of the ore. <laughs> yeah, true. We, I suppose, was there a blacksmith back at Gilbert Town? I don't know. We can find, look for one. Probably there is no, one. No, no, I meant, did you guys see one? I mean, we've been a we, couple of times. Um... We still have to check the proper shops, only the stalls. Uh, uh, no, that is... Granny's. And grannies, yeah. The the man, the tiefling from the stall, even say he thinks we're poor because we're only checking out the stalls and not the actual shops. We um, are saving money. We have money. And I gave oh, you an allowance, a didn't I? Yeah, uh, she spent it on on red meat, didn't she? Not all of it, right? No, I only had like. Too. All right. So, what's the plan? It's the mine first, or first in go to the town and then the mine. I would vote going to the mine first because I don't like the prospect of going in the night or before dark and then needing to come back in the dark, even if it's only a short walk to the shop. Because the way that things have gone the last couple of times we've gone into the mine, we've kind of gone in early and then just done light things for the rest of the day and rested, so... I think that routine is hasn't put us in any further dangers. I agree with that. June, what's your idea? Well, I think hitting uh, the mines first is a good idea, J just in case something happens to us. We would have to go back to Gilbert a second time. <laughs> well, and also, the thing is if we went later on in the day and the shops are short and we need help, kind of like Kara did. Although that wasn't really due to the mine, that was due to something else. But you get my meaning, I hope. Yeah. yeah. What? Whatever do you mean? <laughs> oh, nothing, nothing, nothing. But... Yeah, so, uh, so I think mine well, first, I think shop we'll... later. Um, speaking of shopping, the because mm -hmm. I believe you, Brandon, together with uh, Kawa, you guys were able to sell something. Short words. Yeah. Oh, actually, I don't remember if I, if me or Kawa told you about it. I'll mention it again just in case. I. Do you know when we pick up stuff and we can stir it and we see more information about the item? Mm -hmm. Yeah, if you look right at the bottom, it tells you the value uh, of the item too. It. Oh yeah, okay, so Jun, you did, you did tell him good. No, but I just yeah. wanted to mention it again. Yeah, that's uh, good. I like, no, um, it was worth mentioning that the guy did kind of haggle a little bit, but that price didn't seem to raise any eyebrows. So, yeah, so maybe we could assume common. it's probably yeah like I mean it'd be good if that price maybe that price might adjust you know as we go to other places just so we know what you know basically what the recommended retail price for this stuff is mm, yeah I mean, good I still I mean, think we could have we got well, I mean I suppose we could but like I said well, at least we got some money speaking of and which honest, do we have, because we need some money in the shop, so that we can give out change. Uh huh. Uh, and we need a party funds. Now I've mm -hmm. been handling most of it. The party funds that it is. Yeah, yeah. You gave us the pocket money last time. Um. I was I was thinking maybe it's also good so you, that you guys know if where the money is that I keep here in the shop. Um, I thought we could take shop. the money from the sale in the shop. What did you say? I thought we were going to keep the money from our previous sale in the shop. Well, I just took it off the guy and just kept it on the person. If you remember, last time there was that small uh, compartment underneath the shelf but it isn't really yeah, I was we don't thinking, really have a safe 
right now I've also kept the money on my person, but I was thinking maybe we could use that compartment as in um, as in a little change where we keep it. Oh yeah, so it's but not keeping... a big issue if they take that because they take only a small portion of mm -hmm. that which we have. Yeah, yeah. I, all I'm saying is I don't reckon we should get into the habit of just keeping a bunch of money there. I think we need to perhaps try and find some sort of safe in the near future if we want to seriously think about actually running the shop as a business. Mm -hmm. I mean, it'll work for now. I'm tired. I don't want to go out actually today. We have to. Yeah. Can, can we like have a day off? No. Uh, honestly, honestly, John, if I did that, I probably wouldn't, wouldn't want to go out either. Yeah, I, I'd be. I know that I probably pitch more, more than anyone since we got here, but at this point, I think the best thing we can do is just. We just have to kind of keep trying every day until we get it right. Do you guys not like. I mean, I've been wearing the same clothes for a few days now and I don't feel. No. You don't feel what? Oh. What? You don't feel what? Oh, I don't feel very comfortable. I don't know. I don't know. I just. Uh... You wash them, don't you? Where? We have water. I don't want to waste the magic. water. I don't have magic that can fix okay, clothes. Then just. Let me know whenever you want to hear clean clothes no, your clothes at Casper Station. Merci. And that also means, Brandon. Thank you. Just change, guys. Uh, wow, I suddenly get, got a got an ID. Cleaning hey, 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 God, did you just take that elaborate dress out the store? You say what's nope, the nope, change? Nope. nope, she's already putting it upstairs to get changed. Okay, okay, I'm going to mark that off the list then. Thank you. Thank you for reminding me. Brandon, you you made your uniform yourself, right? Uh, yeah, 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 I did. I'm really proud of it, actually. Um, uh, I get what you mean about, you know, feeling uncomfortable, but you don't, I just don't get, I don't get tired of feeling like Roy Mustang, you know? Like, it's just, I'm living the dream here, apart from this being a living nightmare, but, you know, it's, it's aesthetically. I mean, if, if you could make three more, we could be, like, uniforms. What? Oh, yeah, that would be awesome. Unfortunately, I've not seen... Like, when I came in here, I was just looking for the gloves, and they weren't even the right size for me. Like, well, there was, like, uh, let's see here, about six pairs of gloves, but, yeah, there was only one of them, though, actually... A decent, and you're just too big. So, uh, if we found the appropriate materials, yeah, sure, I could have a crack at making some more like it. So, uh, well, I will but... keep my out. Uh, wow, well, I'm still asleep. I will keep my eyes out for the expression. Even no, no, I will. I will look for it. Oh, oh it's alright. I know what you mean. Um, I don't know. I mean, we're probably going to be going to Gilbert Town at least. Once or twice more. I mean, at this rate, it feels like a bloody daily routine. Yeah. So, yeah. so if we go to, we go to work, we end up feeling like shit, and then we go and buy things to make ourselves feel a little bit better. And that does hit a bit closer home. Yeah. There was no reason for putting it like that. Anyway. <laughs> no, I suppose not. But I want other people to feel as bad as I do. Wow. Oh. I'm just that kind of guy, John. You should know me by now. Yeah, yeah. Don't worry. I think collectively we are keeping the mood right. Nice. Hey, I I feel that I've actually been, at least for me, I've been decently positive. Or neutral. Positive neutral? I'm, positive I'm neutral, outing that. Anyway. Oh, okay. <laughs> Let's get going. Mascara. Yep. I think changed upstairs. Oh, she's managed to sneak back down and is looking to see if she can access her eyes. 
She, she knows how long you guys can chat about stuff she cares little for. <laughs> wow. Kara. Uh, uh, are you taking anything more from the shop? I need to mark off the list. No, no, I can't see anything else. Okay, the dress good. Is quite a fine uh, silken dress with some nice stitch work on it and nice little uh, patterns sewn into the edges. There are no shoulders on it. It reveals some of your back. I still have my leather armor on over this. But it feels nice. It feels silky. Mm. <laughs> so soft. Do a spin. Let's see if the skirt spin. Uh, no. Oh, okay. Sorry. <laughs> to admit, it is a pretty done. nice looking dress. Being dressed up. Because I can get to work. I do like this hat here. Nah. Let's go. Do the mine it is.